Hey guys, real quick video, very quick. As you can see, what's going on here is I have Tractor Scratch Pro running with the DDJSX, so I have the DDJSX in MIDI mode, but I also opened up Serato DJ as well too. And so when you look down here, that I'm operating both things. So you probably wonder, why would you want to do that? Well, I had a guy come into my work one time and ask me about this uh, DDJSX, right? And what he wanted to really know was, um, like, could he have it running at the same time and then run it with, say, Ableton or some some other software, especially, like, VJ software, like, so Resolume, I think it's called, or some shit like that. So that's it. You know I mean? You could actually tell this thing to... Um, Basically, when you hit a button on one to activate something on another program that accepts a MIDI command. So now, unfortunately, to do that with the DDJSX, you're going to miss out on... Well, you might not miss out on anything, to be honest. Because uh, right now it's in MIDI mode. So I can... And what I just did here is the S4 is still hooked up right, but the S4 obviously doesn't control Serato. So I was able to turn that off and then just start stuff up here, right? But if you look, so even though I'm controlling everything here, if I can get this shit to focus, always oh, the same, it's like a battle. If you look over there, So yeah, you could. Anyways, that's probably the shittiest fucking video I've ever done, and I don't really give a shit, because it still answers the question. Can a DG DDJSX run MIDI? Yes, it can. That's a MIDI. Everything on here is MIDI. Everything. So I can make that crossfader. When I do some shit here, I can make it actually work and do some shit with some video software, some shit. You know what I mean? Anyways, later.